I want to talk a little bit about the animation picker and the, uh, well, incidentally on the synoptic situation. So first of all, uh, I want to let you know that uh, synoptic, it's become a legacy picker now. So it's not going to be developed anymore. If there is a bug or anything, if someone sends the uh, pull request, I will take it, but it's not in development anymore. It's there just for the people who historically has been using it and they don't want to change to the animation picker or the project is ongoing, but they want to update MGR but not the picker system. So you can still do it that, but it's not gonna be developed anymore. Now we have uh, the animation picker for a few versions already. And there is a, a bunch of uh, new features that uh, Raphael and James has been uh, adding and doing some pull requests. So I want to show you one that I think is one of the most interesting and is the ability to edit now the picker on the um, 3D view. So that's uh, thanks to James. And I'm just gonna add a new item here. I'm just gonna maybe uh, duplicate the item. And let's see, maybe I want to to have more like this. And now I want to edit more the items. So maybe um, I can show the, uh, the handles and edit like that. But sometimes it's, it becomes tedious. And there is now um, a new, new option that uh, we can convert to nerves curve. And convert back. So basically we can convert. So you can see here we have the nerves, so we can edit this, we can move this, we can move our points or create a new point here, so, so just trying to select the point, you know, do this. And when we are done, we can convert back to picker data. The change will lose it for the anyway, yes. So we have the new picker data updated with that. So, and obviously we can now delete this and save for picker data and it will work. And apart of that, uh, there is an, a lot of uh, bug fixes that Raphael did uh, during the past months. And uh, yeah, there is a lot of love put now on the animation uh, picker. So if you are not using it yet, please give it a chance and start using it because I think it's a way, uh, I mean, it's a much, uh, much better than Synoptic and uh, a huge uh, quality of life improvement for everybody. Thank you. See you in the next one.